What's going on YouTube? The Fender PSVR here. In this video, I'm just going to start by saying happy birthday, happy fifth birthday to PlayStation VR and PlayStation. Uh, this system or peripheral that Sony has introduced to us on this day five years ago has changed my whole perspective of gaming. I love PlayStation VR. I've been a PlayStation VR user since day one. Uh, this system has changed the way that I play games. Ever since this system has released, it's been hard for me to return to normal gaming or flat screen gaming as they call it because you know you have your virtual reality gaming and then flat screen gaming is you know on your PlayStation 5 or PlayStation 4. But anyway, I just wanted to say happy birthday to PlayStation, um, what I look forward to in the future for PlayStation and why PSVR is amazing, and if you do not have it, why you should have it. So, um, starting off with some of the history of the PlayStation VR system. The PlayStation VR system released on this day five years ago. Um, I was expecting this to be big, but not as big as it has gotten. Um, I was only expecting a couple games here and there for a uh, peripheral that Sony has introduced. But over the years, more and more amazing games have been released. You know, you got your Moss, your Moss Book 2, your Frack, your Rashes of Sin, your Killing Floor Incursions, your Evasions, all those games that have a Rush of Blood, for instance, all those games that have started off and ended this system's lifespan because we all know PlayStation VR 2 is going to come out soon uh, or next year sometime, hopefully. Uh, basically, the whole lifespan of PlayStation VR has been amazing for me personally, has changed my life and how I play games. Um, I look forward to seeing what else is in store for PSVR 1 before the system uh, is either discontinued. I don't know if it's going to be discontinued. I think they're going to move your PlayStation 1 games over to PlayStation 2. Hopefully it's backwards compatibility. But um, just the start of this VR gaming that is here right now, just the start of the place VR and where it's going to go in the future is kind of insane to really even think about. Um, there's no other type of way that I prefer to play rather than VR. Um, a lot of people don't like VR because you got to move around or you got to step or slide to the left or duck or they don't really like interactive games. And me, I've been all about interactive games since the PlayStation Move has released. I've had the PlayStation Move since it released on the PlayStation 3 and I just love just having to play games and feel like, you know, motion gaming was the number one thing. There was the Wii, then there was the PlayStation Move. Motion gaming was just the start of what we have now, which is the PlayStation VR, because we started with the front of the screen, you know, waving our hands around, having that one-to-one -one connection with the game and the player, and then VR came out and it just made everything so much better. And even though we're not and the future of VR just yet, we are getting there. And that's where PlayStation VR 2 is going to come in, you know, with the uh, forensic lenses, the adaptive triggers that the NGVR or PSVR 2's uh, controllers are going to have, you know, the haptics and the headset, you know, it's just amazing stuff like that that gets me excited for PlayStation VR 2 when it comes out. And the type of games and the type of interactions we're going to have with the system when it comes out. It's just very exciting to think about and you know the masterminds behind Sony and the people who made the PlayStation VR system and people that work on it and tech demo it and you know basically play different types of things to you know make it better I know they're going to do one hell of a job on it and I'm really looking forward to it but um, I just hope that the future of PlayStation VR 2 is that we get more AAA games a lot of people don't want to play PlayStation VR because they feel like it's not or there's not enough AAA games such as like God of War, Uncharted, or uh, Killzone, or Horizon Zero Dawn, or anything like that. But the games that we do have now have been keeping me company, and I have not really been thinking about whether a game is AAA or not. It's really just the game looks fun to me. How is it going to make me feel? What is the point of the game, and as to why I'm playing it, and if it is amazing to me, and just getting that one-to-one -one feedback with the game that I'm playing. Um, there's not a lot of triple A games on the PS4 system, but like I said, there are a lot of memorable, 
there are a lot of memorable games that I've played that I love, such as like Moss, Farpoint, Arashi, Arashi Castle of Sin, and like Firewall Zero Hour. Those are all amazing games that you would not think that are AAA games, but they get the job done for us, and they have blown me away literally by how well they play, the things I do in the game, the memorable experiences, and just how it makes me feel, you know. But uh, yeah, I literally just wanted to say uh, happy birthday to PlayStation VR. Happy fifth birthday. I'm looking forward to many more. I'm looking forward to PSVR 2's birthday or when it's going to be born and literally where we go from here. Um, I have not had any other VR headset, never played any other VR headset except for PlayStation VR. And ever since I got my first taste of VR, it's just been amazing. And the fact that I have not played an HTC Vive, Oculus Quest, you know, those type of headsets, I know the jump from what I have now to PSVR 2 is just going to be even more like crazy. It's going to be crazy. Just the games that's going to be coming on everything. I'm really looking forward to it. Um, I know y'all haven't heard from me in a while. I literally just got in the process of, you know, getting my place set up. I just moved out of my previous place that I was sharing with my brother. Uh, I now live on my own now. I have my own little apartment here. I got my own living room. I got my whole game set up. My LG CX TV on the wall. My PS5 set up. My PSVR. All that. I have all that set up. So I'm very excited to play these games that I could not have played before or make videos that I could not make before because of time. Because I don't know if y'all know this, but I do work for Amazon, which is like 11, 12 hour shifts. Uh, Wednesday through Saturday. So I don't want to come home tired. But I'm just really excited to start this new chapter in life and to make videos for all my subscribers and really everybody who doesn't follow my channel and everybody who hasn't seen me play the games I love to play as you know I have a VR only channel I only make videos uh, surrounding PlayStation VR games and for those who were with me before I started doing that before I started just showing PlayStation 4 games such as Knack and Uncharted and playing through making full playthroughs of that I now make full playthroughs of PSVR games and I show off PSVR games and I experienced it with my viewers for the first time. Literally every game I play on this channel or every game that I have played on this channel that I've shown was literally my first impressions and the first time I played it because I love to experience my first gameplay with y'all and get y'all feedback and thumbs up and likes and comments and basically just have the PSVR discussion that I love because I love PSVR. But uh, that's beside the point. I'm getting on. I'm rambling. But uh, I literally just wanted to say happy birthday to PlayStation VR. Uh, PlayStation, I love you. I love you PlayStation VR and I love all the people who make these amazing games and continue to make these amazing games um, for the system and I'm looking forward to PSVR 2 and looking to see where the adventure takes us, takes all the PSVR users and even the users that's not on PSVR and plan to come here when PSVR 2 launches. But uh, I think that's going to be it. Um, I plan on making some videos for y'all soon like very soon probably after i finish this video i'm gonna play, I'm gonna play some uh some vr i'm not sure if i'm gonna play like all though or if i'm gonna stream a new game but i literally plan on streaming a game and then making a review um after i stream it or and after i beat it but uh until then man i'll see y'all this is the finner psvr signing off peace out